Welcome back to Raw Sports Talk. I'm Chris, your favorite stat reader, and we have the Islanders hosting the Ducks, and the Ducks are plus 195 on the money line. The Islanders are minus 238. The over-under is six goals. The Ducks getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 125, meaning if you bet them that way, they win this game outright. You win, they lose by one, you win. And the Islanders laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 105, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two goals or more. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. It's supposed to be Dostal in net for the Ducks. And Sorokin has been confirmed in net for the Islanders. Head-to-head, -head, the Islanders are 7-3. The Islanders are on a six-game winning streak. The home team is 6-4. The favorite has won the last five games that they've played against each other. The favorite is 7-3 on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying goals is 5-5. Five five. There have been three one-goal games in their last 10. The over is hitting their last five. The over is 6-4, and four, and the over 6 is 6-4. and four. They played each other twice last year. The Islanders won both games 4-3 in New York, 6-1 in Anaheim. The Ducks are 1-3 in their last four. Five goals, four goals, three goals, eight goals. One goal and a loss, three goals and a win, one goal and a loss, and then two goals and a loss to do in the metropolitan area. Lost to the Rangers, lost to the Devils. Now they've got the Islanders. The Islanders are 2-2 two two in their last four. Seven goals, one goal, seven goals, nine goals. Four goals in a shootout win. Shutout in a loss. Four goals in an overtime win. And then three goals in a loss. Islanders with the money line. Islanders laying the goals. I'm going to go over. Seemingly, the Ducks are not going to have much luck, I think, in uh, the metropolitan area. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut. And please bet responsibly.